My husband thinks I'm a little crazy because I love to eat dinner leftovers for breakfast. And he, ha he just can't understand how I could do that. But actually eating leftovers is a great way to get your protein and fiber and sometimes really good veggies. And on days when I don't have leftovers to eat for breakfast, I have to make my own savory dish. So I say move over scrambled eggs because I've got better things to eat sometimes. So today I'm gonna to show you one of my favorites when I don't have leftovers to eat in the morning for breakfast. And I'm going to start by heating some oil. You can use some avocado oil, grapeseed oil. I've got some coconut oil here. And I'm going to saute some onions. I just happen to have some chopped up red onions in my refrigerator, so that's what I'm using. Probably a quarter cup or so is good for one can of chickpeas, which I've already drained. And I'll just saute these onions just a little bit to soften them a little bit. And then I'll add some minced garlic. I've got two cloves and you can do it to taste. And then I'm just going to add my chickpeas. It's one can that I've already drained and rinsed. I'm gonna put that in with a little bit of turmeric. Actually, probably about a teaspoon of turmeric. Gonna add that and stir it around a little bit so those chickpeas start to heat up. And while the chickpeas are heating, I'm gonna mash them just a little bit. Sometimes I use a potato masher, and if you don't have a potato masher, just use a fork. And then I like to add a little bit of water because you can see how dry it is when you've drained and rinsed the chickpeas. The mixture gets a little bit dry. I like to add just a little bit of chili garlic sauce to get my metabolism going in the morning. Can you see how easy it is to get creative with this? You can add any kind of veggies or crunchiness that you've got in your pantry or in your refrigerator. So I've got a little bit of avocado in here. And obviously I'm not going to use this whole can of chickpeas for one breakfast. I'll have more leftovers in the fridge, right? There we go. And then I like to put either a little bit of cilantro or parsley over the top. Just kind of break it up, put it over the top. And there's breakfast, chickpea scramble. It's really not all that crazy at all. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.